Good morning. Um, I thought after last week's uh, assembly and the, uh, we, 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 I think we almost became viral. I think I had 500 hits, apparently. I don't know if that's good. Um, I thought I'd do something for parents. Um, so I've got my little notebook. Um, I, I did notice last week there was lots of this. I had, a, I had, I had an auto cue on my phone. I was very technological. Um, I just want to go through some of the things. Um, we're now hitting the point where uh, we don't know uh, what's going to happen in terms of school closures and feel that perhaps a weekly um, video or something just to keep you informed of, of what we're doing and also some of the things we're developing because we're, we're finding our way in all of this we're trying to work out what we're doing um, we're aware that people think see things on Facebook about what other schools are doing or all the the uh, different offers and things out there so just try and make sure you can make sense of everything and know what we're doing um, the website is becoming more important for us in terms of how we develop stuff or how we share it with you what I have now learnt is I've got a, a little gizmo and I will put little uh, videos onto our YouTube channel um, which uh, will show you how to access things on the website uh, so you get the school website and my little face in the corner talking you through it. Um, I would suggest you subscribe to the YouTube channel, I'll do a video on that as well. Um, so that uh, we can put stuff up there and you can find out it's on there without us having to send out things on parent pay all the time. We're trying to hit that balance between perhaps being seen not sending enough out and then bombarding you with emails uh, because uh, you, you know everybody's hitting you with information at the moment. Um, we uh, will use parent pay uh, to send things out uh, but also please use the Twitter um, stream although that is in a big screen on the website as well so let's just go through uh, some of the stuff uh, that hopefully will help on the website we've got an information uh, for parents uh, or support for parents on the information tab um, lots of little things there some of them around uh, working with your children at home some of them about how to deal with the tensions of being at home with your children all the time you'll notice I'm in the garden um, my children are gorgeous but very noisy so I'm working out here a lot of the time um, also on the inclusion tab there's lots of things that may not be around uh, just around special needs that actually might help you in terms of certain things to do with your children um, because they're missing that structure of school and as much as they might hate to admit they're missing us and uh, so there are some few a few things to help you in terms of the work set now I think it's important to remember that the school the school although it's been ages since we've seen you they've only actually missed 18 19 days um, and we're making sense of what the world looks like now we had already subscribed to purple mash literacy shed ed shed uh, pixel T uh, times table rockstars TT rockstars now if you are in a house with tablets and laptops and uh, endless uh, internet connection we know that's absolutely fine um, but we know there's an issue for some of you uh, actually getting all your children online we're trying to find a way around that um, when we made the packs up I think it was four and a half uh, days of printing off and delivering and um, I think it was 7,000 sheets so we've got to find a way around that and, and we, we are uh, meeting uh, online uh, fairly shortly actually to, to go through that um, we're also aware particularly for the younger children that yes we can set work on purple mash and things like that they're missing that face-to-face uh, -face engagement now as a trust we've made a decision we're not going to do zooms and teams uh, lessons it's it's fraught with all so many issues but we are looking at how we can use the YouTube channel again subscribe and then the videos will come on um, some staff will be doing things like story times or putting videos on not all staff will do that um, not all staff will want to see themselves uh, on video um, and this is you know not necessarily something that we all love doing um, but do look on there uh, and we'll put things uh, for the children to access and we are also looking for the younger children something around the practical activities in the house so it's yes we know that the phonics and the early math and the reading is important but actually those practical those uh, those uh, 
fine motor, the hand uh, skills and things like that. So keep your eye open for those. Um, do want to uh, also look at um, a recognition. It's hard. I mean, I jokingly said I'm, I'm sat out, out here in the garden. Um, but um, last night uh, when I had my first go, this it won't surprise this is about my seventh filming of this. Um, but um, my son was playing his electric guitar through his amp. My daughter was sat with her headphones on doing some uh, coursework. And my uh, wife was trying to uh, do her... Uh, lessons for her class and um, you know it suddenly becomes a very small house um, and we know that it's tough what I would say is again your child or children have only missed 18 days we can help catch up what they're doing we're already planning for what happens when we come back and we don't know when that is if your child wakes up and it's just not happening do not go to the wall that day on an argument about you must do this, this, this and this because Mr Lord sent us a, um, a timetable. Get them to do a bit of reading. Maybe do a little stuff, a, a small amount of, of stuff around the four operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. A little bit of TT rock stars. But it's not worth those rows on those days where they're not in the mood. Now, if it turns into eight days, then you've got an issue. And, you know, they need to be doing some work to keep themselves going. But, you know, we know this is hard. We know that being cooped up and not being able to get out uh, with the uh, tightness of the lockdown, um, that actually surviving day to day is enough as it is. Now, a couple of other things I just want to uh, go through as I know I'm clocking up seven minutes. Um, we as I've said in other things, have taken on um, the food bank for the village uh, through Agape, uh, which is based in Spalding, that we've supported so much, or you've supported so much over re pre uh, previous years. Now, if you are struggling to put food on the table, and we know we've got parents who have been made redundant, we know have parents who have been furloughed, we have a, a sizable number of parents who are self-employed, we know it's, it, it's difficult. If you ring into school, we will give you uh, details of how to apply and then we can put a pack and those packs are enough for your family for three days of food uh, and we can already see the impact that's had with uh, some of the families we're supporting. If uh, you have been made redundant or out of work at the moment, uh, it may well be that you can apply for free school meals. That would uh, mean that we're able to support you on a weekly basis uh, Miss Smith and the uh, a team are putting together food parcels that we're then delivering out or you can pick up. Again, have a look when the uh, letter comes out with parent pay and see if you uh, uh, can apply, if that applies to you, because again, it's a way that we can help. And finally, a really lovely one that uh, Agape have set up this week. We're calling it the Long Sutton Larder. This is for uh, the families of children within the school and Essentially, it will go uh, onto the uh, Support for Parents tab. There's a little Google form you fill in. And this is, you just have to register for it. And it allows you to come in and take 10 items uh, from the larder. And that's not means tested. You don't have to qualify for it. We just know that for some families, they can't get hold of any flour. Or uh, I think tin tomatoes is something that keeps coming up. Um, and we, we've got uh, some really great support through Agape. So look out for that. And if we can help, let us know. Uh, in the meantime, uh, there is a school leader in, in school 8 till 4.30 every day. Uh, if you need support or need to touch base, give us a ring. Email, you've got my email on various of the letters or the inquiries at longsutton.links.sc.uk. Um, we don't know how we can help in other ways but please uh, come to us and we'll see what we can do so um, we will keep these up and I'll now go and make some little uh, videos for you uh, to show you how to access each of the resources stay safe thanks ever so much bye <laughs>